Looks like those droids got the vessel working again, even with all the damage it had taken. The maintenance officer still won't admit ordering them to fix it, though. Regardless, still no luck accessing the Navi computer. It's been voice locked. Maybe by one of the corpses we found on the ship, like the old woman. If so, that ship isn't going anywhere, unless we rip out the Navi computer and put in a new one, if we even had one to spare. The only reason someone would lock their Navi computer is to hide their astrogation charts. Someone didn't want us to know where that ship was going, or where it had been. Only smugglers do that, or someone with something to hide. That Jedi's got a lot of questions to answer. Who ordered the mining droids to repair that Jedi's freighter? I come in here off the work shift and three of them are repairing the port stabilizers? Did I miss something? Is somebody planning a trip? Because orders were that the hangar was to be locked down ever since that Jedi arrived. I don't know what maintenance is up to, but you can't just commission droids for repairs, especially with half the work shifts in medbay. Those droids are needed to repair the ventilation tunnels before gas builds up to terminal levels. It's not like that ship can go anywhere anyway. Even if it had the asteroid orbital drift charts, the Navi computer's been voice locked. You'd need the access code to get it spaceworthy. Considering this, if anyone sends commands to the mining droids outside this terminal, I'll be forced to enact full override. A lot of cargo from the Jedi's freighter is being stored in the secure cargo hold until we can pass it through the quarantine checks. And as requested, all the programming spikes the security officers wanted confiscated have been stored there as well to prevent further system compromises. The secure cargo hold should be safe enough. If anybody wants to break into it, they'd have to blow it open with explosives.
So is that stupid droid of yours gonna come through or not? Well, I'm beginning to think I was a little better off in my... Hey, what do you know? A little cargo cylinder came through. If he got the turbo lifts working, then we should have a clear run to the hangar. Wait, wait, wait. Don't tell me you're taking that hatch down into the mining tunnels. Are you? That explosion I heard came from below. There's probably nothing down there except superheated rock and collapsed blast tunnels. You'd be an idiot to go down there. Me? You're the Jedi. If one of us has to go, then it's you. Guardians of peace and justice throughout the galaxy, last I heard. There's no way I'm going down there. You might as well lock me up again if you freed me just to throw me into a nest of Gundarks. I'll take Coward over Stupid any day. I'll keep the comlink on just in case you need some help. Not that I'll come running, mind you.